They say the whole world is Irish on St. Patrick's Day. Well, early show contributor Katie Lee is here with some great pub Irish, uh, pub fa Irish pub favorites that are going to make <laughs> you friends green with envy tomorrow when you prepare this stuff for them. Good to see you. <laughs> Good to see Gotta you, stop too. Got to stop drinking in the break. Yeah, it's a little <laughs> early, Chris. Uh, okay, so we're now, making fish and chips here, huh? We are. Most people think when they're celebrating St. Patrick's Day, they're going to drink their favorite Irish beer yeah. or Irish spirit. I'm going to cook with it. So okay. we're bringing the luck of the Irish okay. to some fish and chips this morning, which just about any Irish pub in the world you go to, you're going to find this on the menu. Yep, it's classic. And it's certainly my favorite. Okay, so we just have some all-purpose flour here. Mm -hmm. I'm going to ask you to mix sure. while I add things in. So you just use this. Okay. I'm going to season it with some salt. And I'm going to add in some pepper. Get mixing, okay, Chris. Right, and then some garlic powder. Mm -hmm. And that's just going to give some flavor to our batter. A little paprika, which will give some nice color to it. Because you don't want it to just be like this white-looking yep. batter. You want it to get nice and golden brown. Now the best part. We're yes. going to add some lager. Now, okay. we think of Irish beer, we think of like a stout, like a Guinness. Mm -hmm. But lager is really popular, too. Okay. And it also is a lot lighter. So that's good for the fish and chips. You can stir. You don't want to put the whole and bottle in there? Or I'm going to put the whole, the whole bottle thing? in. Oh, okay, well. So you put this in, you want like a nice thin batter. It might look a little thin, but keep going. Really stir that because we've okay. got to add in our egg whites. And so the lager is not going to overpower the fish. Mm -hmm. And then we have some egg whites. Now this is going to make that nice puffy batter. Okay. If you like your batter more crisp, just leave this step out. Oh, but I like it. Okay. Pretty quick. This is yeah, good. that looks good. Okay, so we're going to take this How and just fold it in, too. Now, do you know how to fold, Chris? I don't, not okay. Necessarily. Now, watch, you just take it and go like that. Uh, this actually looks like it needs some more beer, so add some more in there. Gotcha. And you're just going to fold those egg whites just like that till they get nice and blended in because you don't want to beat all the air out of it by stirring it too hard. You can add Say more. A little more? Okay. A little bit more. This looks good. That's one and bottle. now we're going to add our fish. Okay, so I'm using some cod here, which is a nice, firm, white fish. You could also use haddock or hake. And just take that and dip it right in. Do you want to try it? Sure. Okay, so dip it in our batter. Yep. Just get it nice and coated. Don't be afraid to get your hands dirty. <laughs> using me not wanting to <laughs> Watch it, Katie. I've got an apron on. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I don't put too much batter on mine because okay. I don't like it overly battered. And then I have some hot oil here. This is peanut oil, which gets okay. nice and hot at about 375. So just put that in. How long? About four minutes. And you're going to want to turn it once. Can I put another one in? Yeah, but I'm afraid you're going to burn yourself, so really? I'll do it. <laughs> you have no faith in me <laughs> whatsoever. I don't want any kitchen accidents. This is live television. <laughs> you saying your bad luck? <laughs> All right, so you just let those cook until they're okay. nice and golden brown. Mm -hmm. That batter gets all puffy and delicious and crunchy. And you're going to turn them after about two minutes. Okay. So we'll let those cook and we'll work on our dessert. I'm oh, you gotta, got a real mess going on here. I'm going to your Oh, oh God. Oh, Chris. Oh, whoa, whoa, Do you see whoa. how it flashes it? It makes a mess. We only have so we much have insurance. We're over the floor now. Let you know. me cook. <laughs> Burning his hands <laughs> off. Okay, why may need to go in there? Come on, you've made enough of a mess already. All right, so next up is Bread pudding. I'm no. going to give you a job. Oh, Hopefully you can pudding. handle it. You're yeah. going to get it out of the oven. Yeah, for sure. me, okay? <laughs> get the pot holders. Use the pot it's holders because it's hot. Oh. So this is a white chocolate and apple bread pudding. Wow, it's super delicious good. and super easy. This looks good. And to Irish it up a bit, we're going to make a whiskey sauce, an Irish whiskey sauce. So just set it right here. Okay. All right. Don't burn yourself. Not nice. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So I have Jameson Irish whiskey. This is a good Ooh. one to use. Smell it because it has like a nice sweet aroma. Wow. So really good for dessert time. Yes. And we're just going to whisk some cornstarch in there. So give it a good whisk okay. until it gets nice and blended. See, just like that. Yeah. And over here we have some cream and sugar going. So just pour that right in. Add it in and whisk it up. Now, in about four minutes' time, this is going to get nice and thick and make this nice, rich sauce. It's going to be so delicious. Yeah. You said about and four minutes' time? About right? four minutes, okay. and it comes out like this. It looks so good. Oh, I've got a little bit of it right here. Yep. We'll cut you a piece of this bread pudding. You can flip this. See how they're starting huh? to look good? Yeah, they are. Oh, I sure. love fish and chips, especially with malt vinegar. Yep. I put a ton of malt vinegar on mine. Okay, we got to wrap Easy things up. Over there. So we okay. got a little bread pudding over there. A little bread pudding. This looks so yummy. Careful over there. I don't okay. know that I trust you still. No problem. Okay. <laughs> and then we're going to add our whiskey sauce. Perfect breakfast, right? Doesn't that look this. so good? I think I have to have a piece uh, too. We have some already right. stealing over here. Mm. All right. Okay. Looks fantastic. 